we got a phone call from my mom saying that one of the neighbors had called her and said we were all being evacuated on our street. And I went, for what? Started about 12 miles from our house, so we weren't concerned. We were already on a mini vacation when a neighbor called us and we got the text alert. Until about two o'clock in the afternoon when we got our first um, evacuation notice. When the uh, fire started, I was in the back bedroom asleep in my recliner. I was on the phone with my girlfriend from high school and I looked out the window and we saw a heavy black smoke. And when I saw this flume of smoke, I knew that we were in trouble. When the downwind hit, we were about a mile from the house and you couldn't see 10 feet in front of you. My husband came upstairs and said, we have to leave. And you process this? And I was like, okay. And he said, no, you have to leave right now. After having a fire, they're going through a grieving process. They're vulnerable. They're not always thinking straight. And they need guidance and help from someone that they can trust. It was very difficult for us emotionally you know, to be able to uh, do the dealings, the business dealing with the insurance company. They use very complex terminology that none of us understand. I thought I was pretty smart you know, being trained as a lawyer. I had known nothing about the insurance business. My insurance agent's a great guy. I, I, I like him. He's been helping us for years. And was very accessible. That's not who you deal with when the push comes to shove. It gets handed off to this other department and they're the sharks. I tried to work with the insurance company on our own. And the minute he came in the door, he told us he didn't smell smoke and that damage was slight. Said that they would hire a company to come in and clean the house turned around and walked out and he said, oh good, I have three more days I can spend in Denver sightseeing. And that was the last time we saw him. He screamed, yelled, hung up on me. When they sent this email of here's what we're paying and, and, uh, and they itemized, I sent them an email back. I wanted to know how they arrived at that. And then I realized we needed some, some help. You hear from some people that they think public adjusting is uh, some sort of scam. I came across something that discussed claims adjusters. We actually met a public adjuster from out of state and he recommended uh, Scott by name uh, as uh, the go-to person in Colorado. Scott and all of their staff were very courteous, very, very supportive. It really helps to talk to somebody that has some years of experience in this. He was there to answer questions for people who were working with him or who were not working with him. And we felt that was high integrity. There's nothing wrong with hiring a professional. And at that point, I called Scott at Matrix. When we got to the site, it's like a war zone. It was kind of rough. And the insurance group would go through and pick up stuff out of the rubble and say, now what was this? How long did you own it? Um, was there any damage to this before the fire took place? When did you buy this? About how much did you pay for it? And they were going through several items like that. And one of the gentlemen from the Matrix came walking up and said, excuse me, sir, you deal with me. You leave her alone. You have no idea what kind of relief that was. That was awesome. That was one of the finest moments in my mind of the Matrix. I think what Matrix brought to us and, and to our situation was their experience and knowledge. There is a great deal of peace of mind and communication. The personal aspect, emotionally, they took away a lot of my stress level. And I think it's, when, when you have someone like Scott and his team, Matrix behind you, it is that perfect touchstone to help you move forward. We received probably a good double, if not triple, what we would have received from the insurance company for a settlement. They got me about three times more than I thought I was going to get out of that claim. They double basically the payout. At the end of the day, they get what they're entitled to, and we end up with a settlement that is fair and reasonable, or the insurance company wouldn't pay it. They saved us a lot of emotion, and they saved us our business because this would have buried us. When my husband and I bought our dream home in the mountains, which is something we've worked hard for, for all our lives, and then we lost it, Matrix was pivotal in getting us back up into the mountains that we love. I stand by them. If I lost this house in a fire, I would go right back to Matrix again and say, here, just do it. Matrix has never 
ever cut us off from communication. The Matrix team comes in and it's like having an older brother get you through this. They handhold you through the whole process. They're saying, you need to think about this. You're not going to face this right now, but two weeks from now, this is what you're going to need to expect. And that's why I would recommend Matrix. We'd like to invite every policyholder to come visit our office or we will come to you. It's a no obligation look at what you've got, where you are, and we'll tell you what your options are. And then we can help you devise a strategy, whether you hire us or not, for moving through the process.